Now we got it. Now are we recording? We're recording. Okay. Now you can go to screen share. Okay. And this one. Yep. And go this. Okay. So this is the word. Um, it had, I forget the name. What was the name of that again? Emphasis. Emphasis. It's um, above the P. So it's E. E. And that's um, that's the actual word for passing gas, and that's a little different than at a seed. <laughs> yeah. Cat a seed was um, what I know about cat a seed is that it's um, it's adapted from the word kerosene, and because it's a fuel, it's used for uh, as like with other fuel. Like that? Yeah, it looked like that. All the words just want to be black. Apparently. <laughs> I was kind of thinking it would go away. <laughs> oh, where's it kept going? Yeah, it just it says no color. <laughs> I can't even unhighlight it. Okay. It just wants to be that way today. <laughs> So I was just kind of wondering if that's kind of what you wanted to work on is going over the alphabet. So we can just do that. Yeah, that'd be great. I did um, receive that in the email as well. Oh, Let me cool. see here. Um, here we go. It looks like, I don't know how to screen share, but I can point the thingy at it here. So at the bottom of, I stopped sharing. So at the bottom of your screen, there's a, oh yeah, that works. Oh yeah. Isn't that neat? Yeah, that is cool. Yeah, it came in, it came from the language email. Okay, so it's probably in his. Mm -hmm. Probably oh. in your scent, probably in your scent box. Yeah, I'll check his scent box. I'm just, <laughs> and we can share it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That would be awesome. That would be so great. Um, it says I received it Friday. Oh yeah, that was just okay. Sent to Aramanos, Gmail, Thomas. Maybe. Kara didn't get one. Class books must be. Is it labeled class books? Mm, I don't know. Does it look? Uh, let, oh, let's just click on the email all together. Um, what did you buy? What did you drink? Oh, did you yeah, Lachute Seed books. There's a ton of work or W, whatever those are. These guys here. There's a ton of those. But within the email, itself it's just that oh yeah, a, yeah. B, C, D, oh. <laughs> okay. i found it i'm just gonna copy it and put it back in my weird what that's doing weird oh that one wanted to copy right all right we found it okay this one back to the bottom Okay, is this it? I wanted some. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. Zoom. Uh, the little plus. Okay. There you go. Is that big enough? Yeah. Oh, actually, I can scoom with this. I learned a little bit of scoom. I can zoom <laughs> within the zoom. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> we can zoom in our zoom. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. Sweet. So I suppose we can just work our way down. Or is there any sp particular ones you're like having trouble with, with the, um, did you just want to go over all of it? 
Yeah, probably a good idea. Okay. Just so I can be cool and know what Kara is trying to. Last time, um, Kara called me called me out when in the middle of the the thingy. I was like, uh oh, I don't even know what I'm doing. So James helped me out every every single step of the way. Besides Zitsi all oil call, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> That one's our favorite one. <laughs> so with our with the glottals, that one, that one just looks that's this one that looks like a question mark. Mm -hmm. And that's um whenever uh you see that the sound that comes before it kind of just like gets cut off like halfway through the sound. So okay. if you see, yeah, uh -oh. yeah, like with if you're saying uh oh, you're mm -hmm. cutting you're cutting off the sound halfway through. So it'd be uh oh, so yeah, going all the way through the uh. Mm -hmm. I think I had almost had one of those at the end of my name, the spelling of my name, um, mm -hmm. and so before they settled on how they wanted to spell Snapsitsa. Oh, so it's, yeah, uh, so it's Snapsitsa and not Snapsitsa. Snapsitsa, yeah, Snapsitsa. Okay. Um. Okay, and then A is ah. Ah. Uh, like the A in father. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, and B is b. B. And with the. I know there's another word for that apostrophe. I forget what it is, but it's um, it kind of makes it. And so instead of going ba, it's ba, ba, like it comes up. <coughs> Stricture, yeah. Ba. Yeah. Um. Ah, uh, ba, ba. Yeah. James keeps his right here. Oh. Okay, and then um, C is like a TS sound. So it's What does it say about the apostrophe? Right here. Oh, it's a glottalized B with the structure above the B. Uh huh. So it's the so when um the when. Sure, it's glottal. So again, there's a glottal uh, stop at the at. So instead of so it kind of cuts. The, it still uh, stops the the air. Kind of just you, you stop the air. So it's you make the sound in the back of your throat. It, yeah. So like yeah, and it's pronounced harder. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So with C and the glottalized C, C without it is t. with um with the structure above it. It's like how we say in C C all all quote. So instead of C, it's C. E. 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 E.
Siti. And um, then the C with the wedge, that's like our CH sound. So it's a ch. ch. The child are our chud words. I can't think of a word with the glottalized ch, but that would be a. Okay, and then our D is a D, like in dad. D. 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 And the D with the raised Z. That sounds like um, the D and S in kids. Z. 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 A. Okay. And the schwa or the upside down E, that's like the U H sound of uh, 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 uh. G is pronounced like the English uh, word <coughs> good and guess. G. 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 Yeah. G. G. Like, yeah. And whenever we see the raised W, we round our we round our mouth and round our lips, so it comes out with um, like a more um, airy sound to it. So it's whoa. Go. 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 Like Gustav. Like <laughs> I've been watching a lot of weird French things lately, okay? <laughs> H is um, like the English word in happy. I, it depends on the sound, with I, it depends on the sound. Um, mm -hmm. The shoot seed vowel can be pronounced like the vowels in eat, beat or bait. And it's kind of within, within anything between those sounds. Yay. <laughs> so it can be pronounced E or A, and if it sounds like anything between those two, that's still the, the I. I, okay. Yeah. And J, this symbol, with the J wedge, it sounds like the beginning in the English word for giant. J. 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 K still makes the k sound like in kick. Yeah. Um, with the glottal, with the glottalized K, um, it comes a little bit 
further from the back and you say it a little bit harder. So it's <coughs> And then um, because it's the glottal stop, you still you still cut off the sound at the end. So it's There you go, just like that. And then again with the K with the raised W, we'll be rounding our lips and making it yeah and you'll notice when you start we'll, we'll start hearing you'll start hearing these more um the more we we practice um and then with the glottalized k and raised w it's a is there a word that it means let me know with this one. I want to look this one up. With the, yeah. It likes to be in the middle of words. It likes to be in the middle. Here's one that looks like what what you we got here. It's cool. Uh cool. Hey, look at that. Look, mama's learning the ABCs. <laughs> um, it says here it's like the word for pelt, it has that K the with the w and well the k that you're showing me and then the yeah. upside down e l u glottal stop oh or asib uh, um it looks like this word is the same meaning for pelt it's s k that k that specific k right there uh, a yeah. s uh, upside down e b you want the code? Hmm? You want the code? Oh, okay. She... Yeah. With the baby? Yeah. Okay. The, the K with the, it's a it's kind of like towards the um, the all the glottals are like way back here. Like if you feel your jawline, and it's kind of right right back towards as as it connects to your throat. <laughs> and um, and it's I always forget to remember to make your to round your mouth. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because it changes the sound when you're not. So. Pushing the air out? Yeah. Okay. This is the funnest part of, I thought this is the funnest part of learning the language. When we are when, because when you hold your face while you're making the sounds, you can feel where the air is coming through mm -hmm. and where um, where it's stopping. And if mm -hmm. it um, and then when it's resonating is when it vibrates. OK. Um, and so I'll listen to them and make that sound and I'll hold my face so I can know where that sound is supposed to be coming from the next time I make it. Yeah. Um, but it's just a fun to fun to randomly make these noises. <laughs> yeah. Just around holding my face, making random. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> People look at me and eat and funny. It's okay. <laughs> we just laugh. Yeah. <laughs> but the K is a. So the so you'll get so it'll be in the back of your throat. You'll the air will be blown out with with your round with the rounded with your rounded lips. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. 
L, um, L is like the English bell in live, um, or in feel. Uh, L with the scripture. Mm -hmm. Is it begin words in which you see there is no chapter in the dictionary for it? But it mm -hmm. sounds like the L in the word for feel. Um, this one results in where, where I was talking about it resonating towards the back. Ooh. Mm -hmm. So this one's like in the first L is left, left, and mm -hmm. there's, and then the next one is, is where you'll feel it resonate in the back, and it'll be a L, L. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the barred L's, sometimes it's like this V with a cross, or it'll just be like the straight L with a line across it, so it kind of looks like a cross of like a a crooked T. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, but the, it's all those are all uh, those are all um, barred L's. Yeah. And this, the barred L. Yeah, I'm saying barred L. <laughs> This one, your your tongue rests on the top of your mouth, and then you're blowing air out the side. So you'll feel you'll feel mm. the vibration right on your cheeks. Yeah. Okay. And then um, this one is well, the actual name is called a glottalized barred lambda, but everyone just calls it the running man. Okay. Um, this one. How did he? How did he teach us how to say this one? Night light. We kind night. We we combine the t and with the light, the light part. So the 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 sounds are kind of put together to make. Um, the air is still coming out the side, and you're you're pushing air out the back with the glottal. So it's <coughs> night. And this one is the only one that I know where it actually feels like you're using your whole neck to say it. <laughs> Especially when you're first learning it, it's it's like it it like you're pushing the air out from your back. You'll feel the muscles tense a little bit on your on your neck, so it'll be yeah. M sounds like the English M and mother. Mm. Uh, it only appears as a replacement for B. And then the structured M uh, has a variant, a variant of a rare M sound. Mm. Mm. But with the glottalized, it still it still resonates towards the back. Mm. So, it, mm, mm -hmm. and it's then you hear you hear the sound in your mouth. You feel the the vibration in your mouth. Mm. Mm -hmm. With the glottals, it's always like this. Mm. 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 <laughs> and then with um, N, that sounds like the N in night. Mm. Mm. Night, 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 and with the and again with the glottalized N, it's it's uh it's the throat tension 
and resonating uh, in towards the back of your throat. So it's, mm, mm, and it's you, you can kind of yeah. Mm. <laughs> okay, and then P is like the English word and pop. Pop. A glottalized P combines the glottal stop to the P to trap the air in your mouth. So, and there was, there was sunny in Mount Vernon. Yeah. Sunny everywhere else after you hit. Oh, look at all this. Yeah. Ah. Okay. Um, Q uh, is um, the sound. No, is no O's. English. Um, no. Who is it? The nuts? The squeaky? How do I turn the herd? What do I do? I don't know. It's the mic. <laughs> yeah. My microphone's muted in my video. Oh no, really? Yeah, we can um, have on and our office. Yeah. So the Q is um, like a K sound. The glottalized Q combines the glottal stop with the K, so it'll still resonate towards the back. And with again with the raised W, you'll you'll wrap it around. Okay. <laughs> the air will still be the the will come from the the upper mouth part. So it'll be and the glottalized okay, with the raised W, you'll feel it. You'll feel it. Uh, and the sound will vibrate when you get the tape for your throat. So I'll be. <laughs> they asked why, and I told them it's just because every time we get punched, it doesn't work the next time. Um. No, they just find it. This is the, uh, the S is um, this symbol. It's still like a S sound. The S with the wedge is a sh. And the T still makes a. And then the the sound the sound resonance is from from your tongue like this. the glottal T is again towards the back and that one kind of it doesn't really like vibrate as much as the other sounds but you can feel like the air air stopping back. U is another one of our sounds that likes to not know what it wants to do. Like I. Like I. I can be any anywhere from EA. And you can be O or U. And um W doesn't change, that one's still so and glottalized W will you'll feel it resonate towards the back. 
x with the raised w is a um x wedge i always thought of that as like kind of like hopping a loogie <laughs> they explained it another way it didn't stick that's the one i remember so it's like <sighs> and x wedge with the raised w is making that rounded sound with your mouth as you say why um is still yeah and structured y is a yeah 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 and that and that's like all the others where you can hear the glottal stop towards the back of your throat um is there any questions or is there an, an or any particular one you guys want to um is it okay if i hear you go through the whole alphabet all at once and then just make all the sounds as i point at them yeah okay. uh the glottal because that's the muscle that's right here Ah, uh, ba, ba, da, z, a, da, ku, e, a, i, e. J. O. O. I'm getting these two mixed up. I'm sorry. I'll read. I'll redo the the cues. <laughs> it's block rounded. I always forget to round. Shh. That one's. Shh. Uh oh. What? Yeah. Yeah. Does that help? Just being says yeah. Okay. <laughs> so the other thing, um, we can we can listen to the Lishit Beat Alphabet. Okay. There's an alphabet song. Yay. Right? I 
Okay, hold on. Okay, now that's queued up now. Let me see if I can bring it up on the screen. There you go. Um, uh, I don't know how to. I accidentally brought up two. No, nope, it's still bringing up two. How do I get rid of this one? You got to stop sharing. I did. And then you go to screen share. And then you click that. See, that's what I did last time. See, this one keeps popping up. Minimize it because it's only viewable on your screen. Everything circled in green is the uh -huh. screen share. Oh, so everybody else can only see it. Oh, so I'm just confusing. Okay. All right. Here's the issue three alphabet. That was fast. Yeah. Did you want to go over it again? Cool. Shoot the alphabet. I hit the back button too fast. I'm sorry. <laughs> Did you want to go over it? <laughs> I can also uh, email out the links to the staff if you want. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be cool. <laughs> class he had us record ourselves singing that song. Oh. <laughs> he was like, do this and turn it in. And I was like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> so that was the alphabet, I'll copy the link and then I'll send that out. <laughs> and, um, So is there anything else that you wanted to work on today?
I can't think of anything. Huh? You can think of anything? Okay. <laughs> Okay. So, um, I'll go ahead and post that link. I'll put it on the Sheep Seed Rebels, and I'll send out the link to the email. So, if if that's it, I suppose we're done for the day. Was it helpful? Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh yeah, very good. Oh, awesome. Okay. Well, thanks for coming. <laughs> Thank, thanks for being awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good day. You too. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>